Hello guys, welcome to another episode on my channel. My name is David and today we'll be learning something about network topology or the topology of the network. Okay, so without wasting my time, let's go straight into it. First of all, we have to know what at all is network topology. So, so first of all, you have to define what the network topology is. So, what at all is network topology? Okay, the topology of our network refers to how nodes, device, and connection are physically or logically connected to one another. Let's consider our network to be a city with the topology serving as the roadmap. There are various strategies to organize and maintain a city, such as ensuring that avenues and boulevards can enable movement between the busiest part of the town. A network can be set up in a variety of ways, which has benefit and drawbacks. And depending on our company's needs, different arrangements can provide us with a higher level of connectivity and security. So with this, we have at least a gist on what a network topology is. Okay. The importance of a network topology. What are the importance of a network topology? Okay. For a variety of reasons, the layout of a network is critical. Above all, it is critical to the operation and performance of our network. Choosing the correct topology for our company's operational model can improve performance whilst also making it easier to discover faults, rectify mistakes, and allocate resources more effectively across the network to ensure optimum network health. So this is the reason or this is the importance of a network topology. There are a lot of topologies, but we have the most common ones. So we'll be learning more about the most common topologies. Okay. Depending on the overall network size and our aims, there are various different types of network topology that are ideal for different purposes. So one, we have the point-to-point -to -point topology, the path topology, the ring topology, the star topology, the tree topology, the mesh topology, and the hybrid topology. So we'll be taking each and every topology and learn something a little about each of them. So, the first topology we will be talking about is the star topology. With the star topology, every node in the network is directly connected to one central hub through coaxial twisted pair of fiber optic cable in a star topology, which is the most popular network topology. The central node serves as both a server and a repeater as information transmitted from any node on the network must pass through to reach a destination. So the star topology is considered as most popular network topology. With this, 
it has a central hub. We have the central hub, and it is connected through either coaxial twisted pair or fiber optic cables. So each nodes are connected to the hub. The central nodes that the hub server, both the server and the repeater. Okay. The next topology we're talking about is the bus topology. With the bus topology, the bus topology arranges all the devices on a network along a single cable that runs in a single direction, from one end to the network to the another. Hence, the name line topology and backbone topology. So we can call the bus topology either a line topology or the backbone topology. The network data flow also follows the cable path travel in one direction. So with the bus topology, data flows only in one direction or a line. So this is the bus topology. And the next we'll be talking about is the tree topology. The tree topology. The tree topology structure takes its name from the fact that the central node acts as the network strands with node branching outward in a branch like pattern. Whereas each node in a star topology is directly connected to the central hub. The node in a tree topology are connected in a parent child hierarchy. Those connected to the central hub are connected to other nodes in a linear fashion. Thus, two connected nodes have only one mutual connection. The tree topology structure is frequently used for wide area network to handle many spread out devices since it is both incredible, flexible, and scalable. So well, there is a clear picture of the tree topology. It has branches. Each computer is connected to each other. Okay. The next is a ring topology. The ring topology. A ring topology is where nodes are arranged in a circle or in a ring. The data can travel through the ring network in either one direction or both directions. One direction or both directions. With each device having exactly two neighbors, device having exactly two neighbors, only two neighbors. So that's also the ring topology. They are arranged in circle. Okay. And also we have something we call dual ring topology. A ring topology network is half duplet for the ring topology, which means data can only flow in one way at a time, either backward or forward. So a dual ring topology can create can be created by adding second connection between network nodes to make ring topology full duplex. Yeah. So to make a ring topology full duplex, we have to add a second connection between the networks to make it full duplex. The next is a mesh topology. A mesh topology is a complex and extensive framework of point-to-point -point line 
that connect the nodes there are two type of mesh topology we have the complete mesh and partial mesh partial mesh topology are generally interconnected with a few nodes having only two or three connections whereas full mesh topology are completely interconnected yeah, so the mesh topology is a complex and extensive framework of point-to-point -point length that connects the nodes okay the last we'll be talking about is the hybrid topology hybrid topology the tree topology which combines the path and the star layout is an example of a hybrid topology it combines two or more different topology structures so it simply combines two or more topologies individual departments have specialized network topologies adapted in their demands and network usage in hybrid architecture which are most popular in the large cooperation so this is the end of our today's lectures subscribe and stay tuned stay tuned for more amazing videos Bye-bye.